When most people think of the Ice Belt, they picture some Midwesterners in a custom-built shanty, pulling yellow perch out of a small, dark hole, almost as fast as they seem to be pulling swigs from their cans of Milwaukee's best. Unless you have lived in the high desert of the inland northwest, it's easy to overlook the small, but fertile, Ice Belt of our own. Albeit a brief couple of months, the ice provides opportunities to anglers that could otherwise only be achieved with a boat. With the new year came a cold snap and some safe ice, so my buddy Hayden and I had to check out one of our local lakes known for its larger holdover trout. After some spot hopping, we came across a deeper hole that immediately gave us some action. That one's bit it to you. We'll see you next time he tightens up. We'll, uh... Give him the wood. Oh, actually still there. Nice. Got him. You need a little one. Oh, might be growing a little bit. No, that. <laughs> Fish on the eyes. Break her ankle. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> Pretty nice fish. Oh, Logan, right here. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, that's a good one too. That's a good, good one. Fight him. Fight him. Yeah. I want to see him. See him? Yeah. He's the smallest so far. But on this rod it feels great. Where's he at? Ooh, ooh. Pressure on him. The pressure. Oh, oh, it's a good one. Alright. <laughs> hey, it's a start. Yep. <laughs> Hayden's about one for six by now. <laughs> oh, he can hear me. Got one messing with a worm rod over there. Oh, and I missed the hook set. <laughs> I should have kept recording. That one does not look very big. No. <laughs> Even the bite felt tiny. I'm but this rod also is stiff. I'm surprised you, you hooked him. This is just that straight hook, too. getting smaller <laughs> going in the right direction that's what we were going for today right put power bait on so gave up <laughs> on the worms <laughs> it or not looks like he's going to it's already rolling Oh, he's a nice one. He's a nice one. Oh, yeah, he is. Oh. <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on. Whoa. Oh, come on, come on, come on. You want me to try to do something? Oh, no, just keep filling. Okay. Filling. Just keep filling. Oh. Oh. Got him. Oh. Woo. 
Woo! <laughs> All right. Nice. <laughs> wow. <Wah! laughs> Get the snow off of him. Yeah. <laughs> Finally, we're gonna eat that one. Oh yeah. Nice. Another one, another fish. Yep, 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 yep. A little bit. There you go. Nice. Got him. I think you got a you got a better fish. I think he's at least ten inches. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's kind of a tweener, isn't he? Nice! Alright, hold him up for the camera. <laughs> Alright, that's uh, that's fish number three for you. Yeah, man. You should get it on these little ones. <laughs> So this little guy swallowed it, so I'm just gonna go ahead and cut that line. A little tiny hook will dissolve in his tummy. And uh, he will hopefully live and grow to be a nice bigger one next year. Maybe size that other one. Right, just gonna give a nice little shoot down and off he goes. All right, didn't even have time to grab the camera, but this just happened. <laughs> is yours a bigger fish? It's so hard to tell if it's a little rod. <laughs> I don't think so, no. We got our fish sticks. <laughs> Let's get you move of the day. We got this. Nothing can go wrong, right? As we seemed inundated by the endless stream of yearling trout, it was time to MacGyver up a hot lunch and reconsider our game plan. By the way, if you made it this far, scroll down and click on that little red square that says subscribe for me. I'd really appreciate it. Anyway, plan B, move to shallower water in hopes there might be some larger fish cruising the weed lines. Hit just like straight up snap your tip off, you know? <laughs> Get one. Oh, 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 oh. Which one? Let, him, right let him take line. Let him take line. Let him take it. Let him take it. Let him take it. Oh, yeah, you got him. Nice. Nice. Dude, he looks like a diesel one, too. Look at that rod bend. Oh, yeah, just play it nice and easy. Yeah, the boy. Way to stick it to him. <laughs> Holy crap! <laughs> oh, dude! <laughs> You've gained it on him? Okay. There you go. Just keep keep nice and even pressure on him. Keep, keep pressure, keep pressure, keep pressure. You want me to get him? Easy, easy, easy. Oh! Did you see him? I didn't see him. Was he big? Oh, he was big. Oh! Did he break off? He broke off. Oh, man. That's sad. <laughs> that was sad. Oh. As the heartbreak of Hayden's lost fish sunk in, the sun followed suit as it kissed the horizon, lighting up the lake's cliff lines with a magenta glow. Fishing aside, I think that winter is arguably the most beautiful season we have here. The snow and ice bring a certain calmness, a degree of tranquility, a feeling that everything in nature is taking a long overdue rest. Perhaps we too are long overdue for a rest from the chaos of our domestic lives 
And I have a feeling that a day on a snow-covered lake can provide just that. Tight lines, everyone, and we'll see you next time on Dorsal Fishing. <laughs>